A news alert, a man killed in this hit-and-run crash tonight. Denver police needing help to find that driver. 7 News reporter Jacqueline Allen live at 13th and Calumuth, where Jacqueline, the hit-and-run driver, may have been running from the scene of another crime. Well, police say this all started in the Burger King parking lot just up the road there. They say she backed into a car there and then almost hit a security guard while she was speeding away. They say while she was fleeing that scene, she was speeding here down Calamath and slammed into another car here where she fled again. This video shows Denver police canvassing the neighborhood looking for her. You can see the damage to her red car. Witnesses tell us this all happened around 4.30 this afternoon. They saw her going fast south on Calamath when the white car was going west on 13th and they collided. The elderly driver in that white car rushed to the hospital but died. While witnesses were trying to take care of him, she took off on foot. Nathan Martin saw everything happen. She even helped the, he even helped the woman out of her car before he went to help the elderly driver. I asked him his name. He told me his name. After he told me his name, he stopped breathing and we started CPR on him. I just have it on my mind that, you know, he passed away in my arms. And, and it's just it's just really, really, really hard. And police be, believe the suspect may have been driving a rental car out of Colorado Springs. They're looking at surveillance video in this area to get a better description of the woman. But the witness that we talked to said it was a black woman with gold teeth, possibly in her late 20s or early 30s with a thick build, wearing black pants and a white shirt. Reporting live, Jacqueline Allen, 7 News.